Let's make a rush band sign. This is my friend Ramses. He's been a Rush fan way back since the early days. I met Ramses back when we were kids. As long as I can remember, he was a drummer. Back then, we used to play at the warehouse on the second floor over on Bird Road, just past the Palmetto. I remember us playing there in the evenings a lot. Ramses always was a heavy hitter. And we'd have to turn the guitar amps up all the way up. <laughs> I mean, just to compete with the guy. We recorded a lot through the years. We even did a full-length album around 2011 or so, I want to say. I have that album sitting, all the tracks and, and all, on a hard drive at the moment. A lot of tunes are mixed, but there's still a fair amount of, of mixing that is needed. I hope someday we can release the complete album. So I get this call from Wally. He's like, bro, I got studio time, dude. And I'm like, awesome. Natalino called me and said that he had uh, a slot open to go and play record at SAE and that Wally was uh, engineering there and that he he was hooking us up and he told me that it was for this Oxford SSL board it's like super high-end board with like a great room so I called up the troops I called Eloy I called Ramses I called Wally and he set it all up and then I came down and we uh, we played together that day We see Ramses is kind of like a barbarian. Uh, think of Animal from the Muppets, just a lot bigger. But he's like... He's a loud, heavy drummer. I don't think I'm loud, I'm just a professional. That's all. I wrote and recorded tracks and created a music pack for content creators. My reasoning is to offer music that's royalty free for folks doing videos on YouTube and, and other places. So I have a shop where you can pick it up. It's an instant digital download. I'll leave a link to this in the description. You can also check out the sample tracks on my channel. I have a video where I just go through all the, the tracks uh, little by little so one could hear what's there. A lot of different tunes, a lot of different sounds. And um, I'll, I'll link that video as well. Eloy sent me an uh, email with a picture of this like badass American flag and a, uh, a skull with like guitars and like all these people in the background. And if you read it, it said Born to Riot. And I just was thinking like, that's pretty badass. That song, uh, I was setting up the uh, the drums. Uh, I go, dude, that, that sounds cool. Let's make it into a song. I think that's that's how it was. I don't know. Got to listen to his side of the story. I don't remember it too well. Ramses came over and was setting up his drums in my house, and we were going to jam. And I was thinking, what kind of song 
would he be good drumming in since he's a heavy hitter? And I came up with Born to Riot, the riff. Yeah, I think that's how it was. And then that's, that's how uh, Born to Riot uh, came alive. Here we are, what? trying to fix a string. Eloy broke a string there. We're gonna fix it, dude. Well, Eloy, he always likes to use old equipment and his string's usually two years old. He makes them sound good, um, but he usually doesn't bring backup. He has a lot of faith in his abilities of not breaking strings or not bringing uh, extra backup. I'm, I always bring extra stuff. Like, wow, man, well, you know, I came from way the hell up there to play this thing that day, and then now we have a broken string. Um, I, I messed up, you know. That's an answer. I have pliers in my car, too. I got pliers here. Good. I need those yeah, we need right pliers. now. Okay. What do you need? Pliers. Pliers, need pliers baby. So, so we can rig the... The, the string? The string. Okay. Let me give a short neck on this guitar. This Rush wall art comes with hardware, and you can check it out in my shop, and again, I'll leave a link. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you'd like to follow my story, subscribe and click the bell. That will notify you when new episodes come out. Catch you guys next time.